The Deptford Mice Almanac is a book to accompany the Deptford Mice and Histories trilogies by Robin Jarvis. It was first published in 1997. The Almanac is presented as though it were written by Gervis Brightkin, a red squirrel. There are entries for all the days of the year, and every major event in the main novels is given a date. Also, much of the folklore and elaborate traditions of the mice, bats, squirrels, and rats is recorded in the Almanac. Throughout the Almanac, Gervis writes of his stay in Greenwich Park during the tenth year of Audrey Scuttle's reign as star wife. He also travels to Fennywold and Holborn to ask William Twit Scuttle and Arthur Brown to tell their stories. While in Fennywold, Gervis encounters Alison Sedge, the field mouse who was jealous of Audrey in the Crystal Prison. Seemingly driven mad because of the death of her love, Jenkin Nettle, she solemnly warns that Audrey will not be the star wife for much longer and will know great loss. At the end of the year, the Great Oak, in which the rat god Hob was imprisoned by Isabel in the Oaken Throne, falls down because of heavy winds, and many of the grey squirrels in the park begin to whisper that it was Audrey's fault because she is not a squirrel but merely a mouse. When the black squirrels Morella and her father Mataquai arrive in Greenwich, they and the grey squirrels plot against Audrey, and finally storm into her chamber and oust her from office. Then they give the silver acorn to Morella and she takes the title of star wife. Strangely enough, she bears a resemblance to Alice and Sedge. The almanac ends on this ominous note, opening up the possibility of a new Deptford Mice novel. Equals equals references equals equals.